I'm assuming it will be. Oh, look at this. Can I scan something? Multi-purpose room! Here we go! We can start scanning things. This is taking a long time to scan. Okay, we will scan everything. I'm pretty sure you can make some sort of heated outfit. I would be shocked if you couldn't at some point. Oh, this is slightly heating me up. Good. Cushy setup. Must belong to one of those higher uppers. I got down to 50 out of 11,000 HP at one point during a boss fight. I just did, but I'm back. Well done. Nameplate? Ooh, I can make a nameplate. And an executive desk. Not just a desk, but an executive desk. Uh... It's a Newton's Cradle, but they hover. I've always wanted a Newton's Cradle. I'm an adult. I could buy a Newton's Cradle. I just feel like if I did buy a Newton's Cradle, I would get bored of it in about 15 seconds. But I, I've always wanted one. Like, they look so cool. Can I scan it, please, and maybe build it later? I can. Wall shelves. These are nice shelves. I like these kind of shelves. I don't like the old style shelves that have just like a, a single line and then brackets underneath them. I like the kind of floating shelves, like I have in the background of my office right now. And then a bed. Oh, lovely. An actual bed. It's a quite a nice looking bed, too. With a little bench at the end and everything. Uh, I can't scan these wall lockers. I assume I just got those somewhere else. A bear table. Oh, this is lovely. And a, a basic plant pot. Now we can start making some plants. An observatory. Okay, this is... The game has opened up now. The game has opened up in a big way now. Like, I can start making, like, a proper thing soon. I still don't have the tool that allows you to make a base, I think. But surely I can make a base now. David, you'll be happy to know the Frost Pack is making excellent Focus, progress. Focus, I hate this. I, I hate say, these posters. My management style appears to be uniquely well-suited to isolated planets. I miss you, of course. But I wonder if you feel it too. As great as we are together, we're almost better apart. Just look at how well Prosperina did in her last show. I'm sorry I couldn't be there to see it, but I'm sure if I'd been around, Prosperina is a terrible name. Once this mission is over, I'll come home for a few good months, and then oh, there we go, locker. If we look at Thank God, our proper lockers to facilitate longer-term separation success. I really think this could be a great model for us going forward, romantically and otherwise. Don't forget, I love you from the depths of my heart. Keep on succeeding in your projects. You know there's nothing I find more attractive. Right, that's incredibly gooey. <laughs> Good morning, Prof. Oh Pat. God, still more. <laughs> Just a quick update. Oh, well, we'll go into the next one and scan there too. Achievements and priority shifts. We need you all to get behind. The Spy Pengling project was a resounding success. Penglings. Please join me in congratulating Samantha IU, who is Ooh, now a scanner room. to Outpost That's Zero, pretty useful. helping us dream of future initiatives. Congratulations are also in order for Daniel Valenti and her team at Omega Lab. The closing of Phi Robotics means important funds can be redirected to their Kara bacteria study, which has important Ooh. positive implications for the life sciences. You're all doing an exceptional job. And I don't want to promise anything, but HQ has been taking notice. Keep up the good work, and I think we can start discussing bonuses soon. A jukebox? Sam really got under management's skin. I didn't know she had it in her. A fabricator? A map will come in handy. I should be able to find my way to Phi Robotics where Sam worked. Okay, cool. I have a map now. Jukebox speaker? <laughs> Okay, this is a lot, actually, it turns out. One second, let me eat some food. Take this and this, because this is even better food. Okay, I mean, we've scanned a lot of stuff. Can I actually build any of these, is the problem? Like, repair tool, flashlight, mineral detector. I don't have the tool that allows me to make the things yet, do I? Want to become famous? <laughs> um... Yeah, I don't, I don't see the thing that allows me to make these yet, is the problem. Which uh, seems like kind of fundamental. Ban Pog. Yeah, it's been a while since a ban. 
uh, Altera PDA. Alien intruder. Time, I'm not cheating. Then what's your theory? What's going on? If you ask me, Zeta's been blinking Ooh, a lot. I think it's a tell. He does have a point there. It's allergies. Allergies? Oh, is something in bloom in this frozen sector? Thermal lilies. And if you gang up on me, I swear you're all fired. <laughs> you're not even my boss. Oh, you're all so gullible. You're fighting each other. Meanwhile, look at Parvin. <laughs> just look at him. What am I doing? I'm not doing anything. <laughs> Let's just take this to a vote. All those who think Zeta's allergies are a bad case of alienitis, say intruder. Intruder. Uh, intruder. Intruder. Danny? Oh, I'm just an observer here. I'm going to use my pass. Is there some kind of scientist conspiracy going on here? Zeta, Sam, Danielle, you three are suddenly very aligned. Or, like I said, Parvin is cheating. I'm starting to wish I was cheating. Hmm, interesting. Uh, the framed picture of the pengling is needed, I think. That's that's going to be needed for me. Uh, we have more PDAs. Communications oh God, tower more, more stuff. Blocked. Pick up the posters. I'm picking up as many Another as I day. can. I do want the shaving kit. I don't like some of these posters, is the thing. I liked the poster as I picked usual, up, with just the shave. That was kind of cool. As usual, I went out to see what the problem was. As usual... It was frozen stalagmites of feathered bird excrement. Yeah, that sounds like Antarctic explorers. If you can even call what I have a career. Apparently it's just very boringly milling about looking at penguins. Personally. The week I was out with the flu, I came back to find the tower spotless. Both Harvin the laughed at me when I asked him how he cleaned it. Silly me. As if Parvin would ever clean anything. There's nothing left for me to do but quit. Mm. But I know that's what the birds want me to do. Oh, so he's just going oh, insane. And I got the tower up and running. Maintenance complete. Okay, and last one. Jenny, you wouldn't believe the adventure I'm having. It's just like when we were kids. That is a glorious mustache. Play underwater city. Only sea monsters aren't pretend, and I don't need to hide behind you when one swims by. Because I'm safe in my sea truck. Safe and very, very brave. <laughs> Please tell Dad for me. Thanks so much for the mustache kit, by the way. To be honest, I wasn't sure if it was a gag gift at first. Personal grooming is something of a challenge here, and as you know, I'm a pretty low-maintenance guy to begin with. But you'd be surprised how handy mustache wax is in an emergency. I'm not... I, I've never had a mustache. A I'm not there, sure how hard they are to actually deal with. Truck, I've I never desired a mustache I either. But my friend Sam helped me sort it out. Although, she's had some troubles of her own lately. Ooh, plot relevant. To be honest, I get a little worried out here sometimes. But I guess that's normal, under the circumstances. Gotta expect a little risk, right? I should be happy. I have great friends and a good paycheck. Yeah, he seems anyway, nice. love you, Jenny, and Dad. Please find a way to tell him that he won't find embarrassing. And don't worry, I'm looking for the perfect fish to bring back as a gift. Your favorite. <laughs> I can tell you some coordinates of a place you may want to visit, but I don't think you can go there yet with your current equipment. The game, at least from the last game, uh, you know, judging by that. Oh, hello, little bird. I remember you from the first game, too. Um, the game is usually pretty good about that kind of thing. Like, it's... Okay, you can stop clicking there. <laughs> there we go. Um, the game is usually good about leading you places as you get good equipment. Okay, is there anything else I need here, by the way? Just... Because I'm always worried, especially when I'm talking and streaming. I'm always worried about missing something fundamental. I don't think there's anything else here, but I, I'm concerned about actually eventually having to build one of these bases, because I don't think I can yet. Scan the lockers? I tried to scan the lockers, but it wouldn't work. Like, um, if I scan these wall lockers... Like, I scanned this locker, which is, uh, again, sim very similar to the first game. But these lockers, uh, I couldn't scan for whatever reason. I guess you can't build these lockers... These are made with space-age material that you could not possibly log, uh, want to build. Uh, oh, it's a little Subnautica mug with the lowest quality thing in the world. Say no to sky rays. Sure, I'll take that. <laughs> the thing next to that you, you just looked at. I don't think I can scan anything here. Um, yeah, I think everything in this room has been scanned out. This jukebox has been scanned out. This has been scanned out. 
Yeah, all of this. Okay, I don't think there's anything else I need to do then. I think I can just go. Uh, I, I'm, yeah, I, I don't know what's going to go on, to be honest. I guess we'll go to the next place. I don't know. Okay, so which way do I want to go first? We can go back to base, which I don't really want to do, although we are full on inventory. See, this is where I would want to build a new thing. Like, I would want to start building a base, I think, because that seems useful. Uh, repair tool is not what I need. But I don't really have a place to store anything, is the problem. I can't sleep here. I wish I could just take this base. That kind of seems like it might be a good idea, right? Like, just taking this base. Anyway, let's go. So, we could either go to the... Where is it? The pilot's last known position or the alien distress call origin. One is closer, but also seems to be deeper. So, maybe. My guinea pigs just started running around and squeaking on the floor. I don't know what happened. They might have gotten spooked. <laughs> Can I jump off here? Oh, I don't want to jump off. Okay, we will slowly make our way down, it turns out. Rather than just jumping off blindly. Okay, so it's this way, right? This way to go down. That sounds fine. There should be flowers on the way as well. Yeah, this should be okay. I guess we'll go to the pilot. Again, because it's close. Ish. It's only 400 meters that way. We'll just make our way down to the shore. Looks at top of a skyscraper. Can I jump off this? I don't, I don't know if there's fall damage in this. I wouldn't be surprised if there was. But I don't know. Ah! Oh, God! Okay, so they can burn you, it turns out. Oh, and also save. There we go. Because <laughs> I just looked... I just uh, went through quite a lot of... Um, of dialogue there. Or monologues, really, I guess. So I do not want to do that again. <laughs> Okay, I guess we'll just go off in this direction, right? Again, we have the beacons up. So we'll, we'll always be able to come back here. So I guess we'll just jump off into the sea here and just swim. It should be fine. We have some food. We have some water. I'm not anticipating getting too lost. It's just I might be anticipating some giant monsters that will eat us. Which would obviously be bad. Alright, I'm jumping in. Oh, this is going to be bad. Okay. Something is screaming at me. Immediately. Immediately as I go in here, something is screaming Detecting at me. Detecting stern of an astronautical Saltrans Gov vessel nearby. Vessel name, Mercury 2. Inoperative. Was the Mercury 2 what we were on in the first game? I don't know. Where's the Mercury 2? What got shot down? Oh, Jesus Christ. I hear roaring. I don't like it at all. Okay, now it's getting to me. Now I'm getting kind of spooked. Oh, God, the stuff around me. Maybe go higher up at the surface. Oh, it's so far down. I don't think we can do this. I mean, we'll try, but like... Oh, God, there's a lot of stuff. Uh, I'm hoping you're friendly. Honestly, I'm kind of of the opinion that, like, as long as I don't look at them, they won't hurt me. Which is probably not a good way of looking at this. Oh, God. What am I doing? Ride the whale? <laughs> I'm sure we will at some point. Oh, God. I love them, but... I'm very frightened. Is there going to be some sort of oxygen down here? Like a place I can go? Because I'm very, very, very low on oxygen right now. Okay, there's a... There's a, an alien tablet over here. Which I cannot scan. Um, there's a large anomalous mass of rock that has broken away and risen above the surrounding terrain. Okay. I'm assuming that's... But we need to get up as fast as possible anyway so we don't die. I don't know if we can make it. Oh, God. It's going to be close. We might drown here. This might be another island? Or are these lily pads or something? These look like giant Oxygen. lily pads. 
Oh, look at that. Giant lily pads. What are you? Is that a whale? I think that's a whale. It is. That's a big giant whale. Let me scan this. Mature lily pad. Maybe I should make a flashlight. <laughs> I'm quite far from home. Okay. What does it want from me up here? I'm concerned. Oh, are these things to pick up? No, it's just random stuff. It's quite deep down, isn't it? I don't know what I'm supposed to do. <laughs> oh, this looks metal. I think we are going the right way. It's just... It's strange. Oh, this is more the lily pads. It's just the kind of... The frames of them. One, okay. I think we might have to go back and, like, remaining. equip more good stuff. To, to get down here, because I think we might just pass out right now. <laughs> oh, hydrate. Make a base? That's what I need to do. I need to figure out a way to make a base. Either way, we have actually come to the end of the stream. Oxygen. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to swim back to my base. Right? Like right now. We're just going to go back to base. Oh! I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, that... That oh god, you're still coming? Get away from me. Get away from me, you prick. Go. Away, 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 away. And then run. Oh, there's more coming. Just swim. Just swim as fast as you can. Okay, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go back to the base. Not get frightened on the way back. We're gonna be calm and composed. We're gonna get back to the base. We're gonna... Uh... Save. And then off stream... Oh god! Oh god! Run! I, I don't know where he went. I can hear more screaming, though. Oh, God, he's over there. Run in this direction, please. Just swim. Just swim. Hydrate. <laughs> oh, God, another one. Run. Don't get eaten. Please. Uh... Just weave in between these things. They're smaller. Or they're bigger than you, so you can outrun them. Oh, no! Keep keep swimming. I don't know where they are. And we're still quite far away. Okay, we need better equipment and we need a base. That is clear to me now. Oh, God, another one. Stab them? They're quite big. <laughs> oh, God, they're everywhere, too. They're genuinely everywhere. Okay. Breathe and then down a little bit so you can actually see where you're going. Okay, we should be coming into the safety now. Oh god, there's another one there. <laughs> just hold down the button. And just, anytime you see a shadow, just move out of the way, but just hold down the button. The problem is that there's shadows all around me. I can just hear them in the back. I can hear them in the back. Just going back and forth. <laughs> uh... Right. I think we're out of danger. Maybe. Oh, nope, he's coming. <laughs> Maybe we're not out of danger. What is that? What the hell is that? What? Oh. It's like... It's like a swim cage thing. Or like a shark cage. What the hell? Mineral detector we already have. A flare we don't need. A nutrient block, I'll take that. Okay, is this like just literally a little safe spot? Um, can I scan this? Yeah, just titanium. Okay, I'm, I'm not really sure what this is, but it's like a little waypoint, I guess. Oh, you can probably swim in here to avoid the sharks, right? Yeah, that makes sense. 
It's clearly a little shark cage, or maybe like a little studying area. Whatever. We're nearly back. We're so close. Scan those crates? Sure. I'll scan those crates. I don't know if I could scan those crates, but I may as well try. No, I can't scan these crates. It's, uh, it's kind of not as obvious as you'd expect, really, what you can and can't scan. But it is a good idea to just literally right-click on everything with the scan tool as you come across them. Batteries don't seem to last that long, I'm noticing. Okay, I think we are now coming into the shallows and we're no longer in danger. Okay, that was a, a rough trip, but we discovered quite a lot. We discovered another person on this island. We discovered, you know, cool blueprints for stuff we can make with a base. That's all cool. Yeah, I think uh, next time, next time I play, we will make a base, right? We'll make a, a proper, good, cool base and, you know, be able to do stuff. A woman in an exosuit. What was that woman's problem? The one in the exosuit. Like, I need to say which woman. And what the hell is she doing on this planet? It isn't exactly Ooh. a happening vacation spot. I can make hot drinks. She knew their terrain well enough to make a dramatic entrance by jumping off a sheer cliff. So I guess she's been here a while. But how long has she been following me? She I think it's the same woman from last time. Or off her land. What in this frozen slush bog could she be protecting? Unless she's camped out somewhere. She's definitely heard of Altera, though. Did she meet Sam? Maybe. I think, yeah, I think that's the fir the woman from the first game. I, I do make the vehicle thing. I don't think I can, can I? I can make a beacon. A mobile beacon, vehicle bay is a computer chip. How much is a computer chip? Fugitive is table, coral, and copper wire, so that will be next time as well. But I actually can make it. I was wrong. Okay, next time, I will build a base, make a vehicle thing. We'll be even more amazing and kitted out. But uh, for now, I do need to go. So thank you for watching. It's been great. It's been a really good stream, actually. Um, yeah, just a genuinely good stream. So thank you for justifying me playing this game. <laughs> I would have played it anyway, but it was fun. Anyway, thank you, and uh, yes, I am saving. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Come back again on Sunday or Monday or whenever. You know, I'll play lots of different games. Check my schedule and give me a follow if you haven't already. But I think everybody watching is a regular anyway, so you already know. Yeah, my next stream is on Sunday and I'll be playing horror games. So come by then if you want to see me be spooked. But uh, yeah, thank you and goodbye.